Good afternoon. Today I have Chuck and Megan with me and we're going to try four different odd foods. The first item is potted meat. I have very low expectations for this. It was 39 cents at Walmart. It doesn't even say what kind of meat it is. It's just potted meat. Next we have smoked oysters. I hate oysters fried or raw. I can only imagine how bad they're going to taste out of a, a tin packed in oil. <laughs> then something that could be a really good treat. Chuck has been on a Gouda kick recently. So I purchased some mango habanera Gouda. We'll find out how spicy that is. And then the last thing is a treat that we've been waiting for for quite a while. Takis. Blue heat Takis. We've had Takis in our house before, but never blue heat. So we're very curious to see how these taste. And for some of these foods, uh, we have celery uh, because of the heat and some Triscuits as well, because uh, we'll probably use that like as a chaser or uh, a side to go with the potted meat or smoked oysters. Stay tuned. All right, the first thing we're gonna try is the potted meat. It has a peel away lid. Ew. What does that look like? Oh no. no. That's gross. It smells like cat food. Oh, can I smell it? Yeah. I mean, not that we have any cats it does in our smell house. like cat food. Reminds me of Vienna sausages. Yeah, that's what it smells like. Vienna sausages. It smells but like cat food. It's like in a pate. It, it. Oh, makes me think of a brain. <laughs> it looks like a spread. Well, we're going to spread it right on the cracker. <sighs> Only because... Um, oh, God, not that much. It's not that much. That's a lot. I don't have high expectations for this. I have less than high expectations. I have lesser. Okay, um, I will take this one. It has the most Thank on you. It. And the best thing to do is just, just... Eat it. I'm not doing that. You're right. Vienna it's sausages. like Vienna sausage. It's, oh. it's pureed Vienna, Vienna sausage. Go ahead, try it. You've had them before, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Go ahead. Give that a try. Why do you think it's a small bite? I don't want to ruin my lipstick. It's okay. <laughs> oh. You gotta take another bite. That was too I'm small. spicy. Spicy? Like, oh. So you don't like it? No. No? What do you think? It's bearable. About nine times out of ten, you've said everything's bearable. Yeah. It's I good. had the most honest reactions. I would not eat it again. Grace, no. would you like to take a try of this? No. No? Okay. Um, my honest review is that um, it's gross because Vienna sausages, that's one level of disgusting. But when you take it and you cream it up and put it in a can... That, that's really gross, so I, I will not be eating the rest of this. Do you want some more? No. No. Know. I bet you Bailey would eat it. <laughs> yeah. We're not going to give it to her. All right, so that's uh, potted meat. That's a big no from all three of us. Yeah. Okay. All right, thank you. All right, the next item is the smoked oysters. It does come in a can that's exactly like a can of sardines. Or cat I'm worried about the smell though. Oh yeah. Sniff it. No, that. Oh. Those are what? Like... What the heck is they're, that? They're, they're oysters. Looks like. Those look like rotting organs. Oh, don't say that. I oh no. You have to put that whole thing in oh, your mouth. Oh no, I'm gonna cry. Look, I'll tell you what. I'll oh. put. I'll put two on mine, and you just do one. I'm, I'm, I have tears. <laughs> oh. There you go. Oh, Finger. God. I don't want to. Okay. Oh, God. My nose is running. <laughs> I wish I had some hot sauce. I can't. I can't. How do you do that? I'm not. No. Mm. Go ahead, Chuck. I would just put the whole thing in your mouth. It's easier that way. Go ahead, Megan. I'm scared. Oh, 
scared. Hurry up. I'm scared. Whole thing in your mouth. I don't Just want to. Take a big bite then. Um, no, I can't. Come on. Daylight's burning. No, I'm not doing that. No. No, 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 no. I'm terrified. No. This is, I, this is no. No. <laughs> no. That was a bad idea. I, ew, bad. I got the little flavoring on my tongue. Mm. Want some <laughs> celery? Okay. Okay. Okay, so. What do you think? Yeah, I could not swallow it. You couldn't swallow it? That was just gross. Then I know I could She wouldn't even try it. Grace, see if you can zoom in on this um, can just to show the awesome texture. Looks like rotting organs. It looks gross. Okay. Someone told me that I need to have a rating scale. And, like, I think the worst thing that I've had I wash out my mouth. was the liver, <laughs> liver and onions. And that's, like... The worst. So everything is based on liver and onions. These are way worse than the liver and onions. Those are so gross. They do have a smoked flavor to them. Um, I remember when I was younger, my dad used to buy uh, smoked herring. And it, that it has a taste of that. Um, but the texture and the smell is, is just obscene. Uh, I do not recommend... Uh, smoked oysters oh, in a can. That was very disgusting. It made me cry. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I will not be eating that ever again in my life. All right. Those those smoked oysters were really rough. Um, yeah, they were really bad. Now we have the Gouda cheese, which is the mango habanero. Uh, I do think this is going to taste really good. Uh, I love spice. For you. Um, Chuck, I'm going to give you a small slice here. I'll probably take the smaller you can have it with or without cheese, your choice. It's I already think. cheese. I mean, <laughs> with or without Trisket. It smells pretty good. Yeah, so let's all take a bite at the same time. All together? Yeah, why not? One, oh, two, geez. four. That's I don't, spicy. I don't think it's spicy at all. Uh, paper towel. What? A paper towel. There's one right there. Uh. <laughs> what, what do you think? I couldn't really taste the Gouda, but there is definitely some spice. I can taste the mango. It's got like a <coughs> tropical taste. I could take a, I could taste the sweetness for a second. <sighs> What's really weird though is biting into cheese that <laughs> <laughs> biting into cheese that has a tropical flavor to it. That, that's kind of a weird taste. Yeah, it kind I am. of overshadows the taste of cheese. It tastes like nothing, then it tasted terrible. <laughs> I taste the mango first. And then later, I have a faint bit of heat. But it's nothing like makes me want to go drink a gallon of milk or anything. <laughs> wow. Or, or a celery stick. So, Megan, what are your thoughts on yours? All right, so, basically, uh, tastes like nothing. tastes like no flavor whatsoever. You barely took a bite. I did take a bite and now my teeth are burning. So then, <laughs> so then, um, what was I saying? Your oh, your teeth were burning. Oh yeah. <laughs> so tastes like nothing, but then, wait, but then, um, it tasted really bad and it, uh, uh, tasted spicy and then vomit. I don't oh, know. Oh, come on. I don't know. I need water. It wasn't that bad. No. <laughs> boys. Of all wow. the things we've had. Oh, just so mean boys. Honestly, probably one of the better ones. Like it's it's not one of the things which makes you want to it's like it's one of the things which you would eat again, just not like once every two months sort of thing. Oh, quickly. Like not something that you would intentionally seek out to eat, but it's something that if you were to find it you would probably try a little bit of it. Yeah, every couple of months. Yeah. I agree. Uh, I actually like it. I like the heat. Um, it is a little bit weird to bite into it and taste a, a mango flavor, but I do like the flavor. That was mango? Um, yeah, mango habanero. Tasted like rotten something. Well, anyways, I would, I, I would give it a thumbs up. Chuck, what are your thoughts? Um, I'd say it's 
Six out of ten. Six out of ten. So it's above bearable. <laughs> yeah. Above and and Megan's saying absolutely not. <laughs> Thank you. All right, between takes, I have to admit, I had another piece of the mango habanero gouda, and I like it. It's actually starting to get better the more I eat of it. Um, so I'm giving it two thumbs up, actually. So if you like spice, and you like a little bit of a different flavor with your cheese, I do recommend that. But the most exciting product so far to date that everyone in the house have been waiting is waiting for are the Blue Heat Takis. So without further ado, Oh, that's a little disappointing. What? So, oh, I smell. So, take a look at the blue there versus the blue picture on the bag. Obviously, it's gonna not look exact, but that looks like a dark blue compared to a cyan. Yeah, that's kind of weird. Oh, little got like hot water on it. Um, nonetheless, traditional taki rolls. They smell like regular Takis. Smells like regular Takis. Let's go, let's try them. Mmm. That's good. That is really good. I like it. You know what's funny? This is spicier than the cheese. What? This is spicier than the cheese, and she's going to town on the Takis. Nuh-uh. It is. It is. My mouth's gonna burn in a second. Now, well. <laughs> Your teeth are blue. No! <laughs> I'm pretty sure these are just blue Takis. Well, I mean, they are. <laughs> <laughs> like, literally just they added blue dye. Grace, do you want one? After we can't rest Okay. Wow. I like crunchy snacks. And this one is a 10. I think it's really good. This is probably the best Taki I've ever had. There's a mm -hmm. lot of varieties of Takis. The Blue Heat is the best. Who would have known? What do you think? I think it's good. I think it's not as spicy as some of the other ones, which makes it a really good combination. Yeah. Yeah, it's really good. What do you think? <laughs> um, um, really good 10. Wow. We found something that we all agreed on. High five. High five. All right. Thanks for sticking around. This video is a little bit longer than the others, but heck, it was four different foods with a side of Triscuit, celery, and water. Thank you, and uh, hopefully you learned something today. Aye, don't, Captain. Don't eat canned, smoked oysters. That's what I learned today. Thank you.